In this video, we're going to show you how to use Trello as a simple help desk solution. So if you haven't watched our video on the orientation of Trello, go ahead and click on the link in the description of this video and watch that first, then come back to this video. Okay, so I've set up a board under my Trello account for a help desk. And I have lists created in here for new tickets, doing, done, and build. And so the idea here is a ticket comes in, need help with Windows Windows 98. All right, need help with my Outlook. Need help moving my computer. Now these are all computer type tickets, but you know whatever help desk you guys have, this would work the same for it. The idea here is you basically have all the incoming tickets show up here as you're working on them. You slide them here to the doing column. You can make notes if needed. And when you're all done, when the client verifies that everything's good to go, put them in the done column until you bill it. Once you build it, it's in the build column. That means it's like done, done. So as you can see, it looks pretty simple. Um, basically, you just want to keep everything moving to the right. One little trick that's going to help you out here is automation of the ticket creation. So obviously people can call you and place a ticket that way, um, but that's manual. How great would it be if they could you know, create their own tickets and save you some time? So there's a way to do that. When you come over here to menu, there's this email to board settings. And what that does is it gives you an email address to the Trello board and anything that's emailed to that email address is gonna automatically create a card or a ticket in um, one of these lists. So it asks you which list you want to create it in. So go ahead and choose new tickets. And basically what you can do now is just include this email address wherever you want people to create a uh, help desk ticket. So maybe you want to include this in your email footer saying something like, you know, click here to submit a ticket and make the click here just link to this email address. Or you can set up a form on your website that lets people put in all the information about their about their request and basically the way that forms work is they always end up being translated into an email that goes somewhere so you can still have that email go to you or you can CC it to this email address right here and basically when they fill out that form it submits an email and it will show up as a ticket or a card here on your help desk system then all you have to do is help them put it in done bill them if needed and that's pretty much how you can use Trello as a simple help desk solution. Now the one drawback of doing this is that you know Trello is not going to communicate back to them unless you add people to your help desk Trello board, which you don't want to do because you don't want them to have access to the whole board. You only want them to have access to the communication on the tickets. So if you need to go back and forth with them by email or something like that, then you may consider using a help desk solution like Zendesk and finding some kind of API bridge that will create a help desk ticket if needed in your Trello board every time somebody submits a Zendesk ticket or a fresh desk ticket. Anyway, if you don't require that email communication to go back to them, like for example, if you're just gonna call them to make sure that whatever you've helped them is solved, then this basically works fine and it's completely free. So it's kind of a good solution. That's how you use Trello as a simple help desk. Be sure to watch our other Trello videos to see other ways that it can simplify your life.